This is Grand Summoners, a pixel RPG gotcha game. And this is NBA 2K24 My Team Mode, a player card collector game to compete in various game modes. NBA 2K24 My Team Mode has a gotcha system or it's similar to it. Let me tell you why. Gotcha Games is a popular genre of mobile and online games that establish a monetization mechanism that often translates to gambling like slot machines or games that promote gambling like blackjack. The expression gacha originated from the Japanese word gasapon or gashapon. Gasapon is a vending machine where you will receive a random prize when you use it. Something that is similar to this system in virtual sense is loot boxes. In gacha games, players spend in-game currency or real money to acquire virtual characters or items at a completely random system. Gacha games have multiple genres from card collectible games to RPGs. They get players to check out their gameplay characters or collabs with other IPs. Developers get players to check out their games by interesting characters, gameplay, or even other collabs with other IPs in their gacha game. My team is a game mode in NBA 2K that revolves around making and managing your own basketball team by collecting NBA player cards. Here's a quick overview of the game. Card collection in my team is where the gacha system comes into play. You need to rank up your level, do challenges, earn rewards in various game modes or pull packs to get players cards. Also, you can do all three of these if you want to. You have to use in-game currency, which is called VC or virtual currency in NBA 2K or use real world money to pull packs. Now building your team is easy. Players use the cards that they collected to produce their team to their liking. Of course, you can create a team with a diverse playstyle. Gaming challenges can be played once the player team is built. These game modes can be online head-to-head -head matches, single player challenges, and more. By completing these game modes, you can obtain various rewards. The more you progress and complete challenges in different game modes, the more rewards you can get including player cards. There are different seasons where cards and events are released just like gacha games. With the in-game currency in NBA 2K called VC, which players can earn through gameplay or buying it with real world money, VC allow players to buy car team packs, upgrades, and other in-game items to enhance their team. But with playing my team, the ultimate objective is to create a powerful team that can compete successfully against other player squads in various online and offline game modes. The pros of gacha games are being able to experience items or characters you might like. You might even get the joy out of summoning characters and items in gacha games for the suspense. Another thing that you can experience is different IPs in gacha games. In Grand Summoners, the game has different collabs throughout the year like Kill a Kill, One Punch Man, Yu Yu Hakusho, and many more. With some gacha games, there are amazing graphics, interesting storylines and lore, and a different range of characters. An advantage of playing gacha games is that most gacha games are free to download and free to play if you choose to play that way. This allows anyone to play the game without spending real world money. They also can have a small or big community surrounding the game which the player could connect with in different ways. There are downsides size into playing gacha games for some players gacha games can get addictive this mainly happens around the monetization method inserted into gacha games the rng or randomness in gacha pools can lead to impulsive behavior this might cause players to spend real world money to chase characters or items in the game with some gacha games it might fall into a pay to win aspect of the game where some players spend money to have a bigger advantage over players. This might cause a struggle in players' lives with time and financial management. Players do this so they can stay up to par with the content and competitive aspect in the game. To wrap this up, Gacha Games can offer vibrant content and a different gaming experience for players. It's important for players to be careful about how much potential spending money and addictive habits can occur. Just remember, Gacha Games can be enjoyable if you balance everything right. With Gacha Games and NBA 2K24, my team game mode shares some similarities like collecting characters and items. The my team mode uses the Gacha system where they use in-game currency to contain characters and other items in the game. But of course, NBA 2K24, my team mode uses the card collecting aspect in the game to build players' best teams to compete against the CPU and other online players in a basketball setting. So does this mean NBA 2K24, my team mode is just a flat-out Gacha game? 
or similar to the Gasha system? Well, let's find out. And this is where the money comes in. The Gasha system. This is where this is where it all starts. VC. You can buy it right here, as you can see, or you can buy my team points, which is the main currency for this game mode. Now, if we go up here to the pack market where we buy packs so we can pull cards so we can use those characters or players from those cards right here as you can see we use vc or my team pass whatever you want to use or my team coins excuse me now with the regular uh the nba's backpack it has uh joel and bead on here 93 overall okay yep uh-huh not bad now we're really gonna gamble our chances here we're gonna do the 10 pack opening right here we just have a one player card and four random items okay with a chance of pulling an nba is back player so one of these players right here we have a chance of pulling okay we're gonna use the my team points 10 packs <laughs> we're gonna open all of these flip them all man oh hold on this one's shaking purple purple anything else anything else now we could flip uh a card individually but we're gonna flip them all okay we're gonna flip them all let's see what we get right here uh oh uh oh it looks like we got one off the bat power four lori we didn't get lori we didn't get lori we didn't get lori got my, my got my guy though pretty nice got my dad I'm, I'm fine i'm fine he's been doing good he's been doing good record 15 points okay i don't care about the goals right now <laughs> i'm moving up packs we're opening up packs right now come on gold oh my gosh nothing good nothing good but hey for the first <laughs> for the first pack that was pretty nice that was pretty nice all right nothing is shaking usually when it shakes it's like it's pretty decent so we're just gonna keep on going yeah nothing's here yeah nothing's here bro oh, come on man this is what i'm talking about man you want all the players you're gonna have to spend that currency bro that's it an emerald is that what it is i don't come on Jalen Bronson you're that guy but oh bro ah okay maybe we get another one come on that's looking too good boys that's looking too good we got this one we got one more left we got one more left all right one more do we get somebody right here gold gold oh my gosh <laughs> this is what I'm talking about here. Okay, we get a guaranteed liftoff player card right here. And we're gonna do this, okay? This is this is a gamble. <laughs> this is a gamble right here. If you have luck, just like summoning on a banner. With low rates, a lot of characters. Let's see. I don't even wanna I don't even wanna hover over. It's not even shaking. It's not even shaking. This was a waste. Luke Longley? But there are lots of ways that you can get, you have a chance of getting uh, some of these cards. Like I said, go to the exchange pack. You can do challenges from single players, uh, multiplayer where you can get characters and everything like that. And just leveling up, uh, leveling up the battle pass. Literally the first one, you got a victor um, card at the very end at level 40 you get it should be will yeah will chamberlain yep should be will and see you get packs too so all of this uh pretty much helps out if you do uh especially if you get the paid battle pass you get more stuff too for my team and everything like that so but hey you definitely can do this free to play you do not have to spend money for sure it is similar to the gotcha system bro right here this is it nobody's not talking about it i don't see why has nobody hasn't said Yo, they got a Gasha system in this, bro. <laughs> the whole Gasha system right here. This is, this is, this is not. I I don't have good times here. <laughs> I I'd had some bad experiences here. All right, we some pain, some pain. Now they got King Summon for Halloween. Okay, respect. I have everybody right here except for these two characters. And we have Sinki. See, yeah, they, they changed the name. Okay, Hazuki. Okay. And, okay, we got Tom, we got Sanji. 
Really? That's it on this banner? Let's just summon. Let's see what happens. Okay. First summon's back. Actually. <sighs> These two summons right here are my first summon back. This is the first time I logged into Grand Summoners in a very, very long time. I didn't even know like the crossover. I don't even know what the crossover name is that came through. I'm gonna have to do my research. Like I haven't been playing at all. Okay. First summons, I think I should, you know, give something, you know, give me to come play the game. Something, something to come, you know, something to do. I'm gonna have one five star. Okay, no way. These are all the characters that we're able to use, but we don't want these characters. We want a good character coming from here. We want the screen to go black, and the screen doesn't go black. When the screen goes black, you get a new character, and that this, that didn't happen. All right, I already have this guy. Yeah, I never should have logged on to Grand Summoners. I never should have done it. Gacha Games and the My Team Mode both have a community where players like collecting and using those collectibles in virtual gameplay. Both Gacha Games and NBA 2K24 My Team Mode both have a collecting and strategy based aspect in their game. The game truly separates when it comes to the genre of the game and its gameplay. If you enjoy sports games, RPG games, or strategy games, there's a unique gaming experience for everyone. Whichever one you decide to play, just enjoy the game and balance out the gaming experience.